Friday delivered some sensational action with four games to finish top 16 round 13, including one of the games of the season going to the final shot and a legend honoured as his team claimed a playoff spot. In perhaps the best game of the season, Laboral Cucha Vitoria Gasteis and Real Madrid offered an outstanding showdown which had a little bit of everything. Comebacks, wild three-pointers, huge dunks and it all went down to the final shot. Madrid got 18 points from Sergio Rodriguez but Laboral kept fighting and Davis Bertans buried the game-winning shot from downtown, securing home court advantage in the playoffs, 89-88. One of basketball's oldest rivalries resumed as Ceska Moscow hosted Chalgiris Kaunas. The visitors started confidently and led by 10 in the second quarter. But a 14-3 start to the second half, inspired by Nondo de Colo, put Ceska in control for good. De Colo finished with 26 points and 7 rebounds as his team claimed a 186 victory, which also guaranteed home court advantage in the playoffs. It was a crosstown rivalry with the visitors' fate on the line as Fenerbahce Istanbul hosted Anadolu Efes, which stayed close through half time on Thomas Ertel's heroics. However, a third quarter explosion, led by Luigi Datome and Bogdan Bogdanovic, saw Fenerbahce build up leads up to 19 points before Efes rallied late but ultimately ran out of time, losing 90 86 and being eliminated from the playoffs. On a night, three-time champion Dimitris Diamantidis was officially named a EuroLeague basketball legend. Panathinaikos Athens hosted Sedevita Zagreb. The Greens took control from the get-go, and although Sedevita rallied with a big third-quarter run, Panathinaikos held firm to celebrate a 76-60 win, keeping alive its chance to hold home court advantage in the playoffs. Don't miss any games, subscribe now at EuroLeague TV.